for the whole weekend actually which is like that's not happened for a very long time um normally he just goes for the sunday and comes back on monday and obviously he'll go to school and then i'll pick him up um but yeah he's, he's there for the whole weekend which is like great for him he's really really excited um but i just i don't know i feel like especially now i have more children at home with me so like daisy and stanley um i feel even worse about him going because it feels very very like us and then him leaving and I don't like that change and um, I think I'm just quite like hypersensitive to it as well so I always worry that like is that going to affect him is he going to feel left out especially because like you know before we had Daisy so Daisy was the daughter and Bill was the son whereas now we've got like a daughter and a son Stanley's just in this little snooze pod here asleep while I get ready and um I don't want Bill to feel like he's like a third wheel or something that's like interchangeable because it's really not like that but then like I think he's like five nearly six and does he think of things like I do as a mum probably not um but I love him I love him so much and it's just it's hard um but yes yeah, so I'm trying to be perky today and I'm gonna put proper makeup on Woo. and um i'm gonna you know try and get us all out of the house and mark and daisy are downstairs chilling for now and i um, want to make the most of it and i don't want to be like a sulky susan um because you know life is too short and we've got to enjoy every version of family time together haven't we because it wouldn't be fair on daisy and stanley if i was moping all the time if bill wasn't here so yes that is that so i'm gonna crack on with sorting this face out and i'm sure i will tune in in a little bit did you not want to stay asleep and let mommy get ready no you did not did you look at those little eyes oh, you're like my biggest fan oh you're talking lunch which was really nice we only went to a toby carberry because we just wanted to go somewhere cheap and that was like child friendly and i had a yorkshire pudding wrap and so did mark and i feel like a dirty dirty animal now um it was it hit the spot though so what can you do i'm just about to give this little one a feed and mark's taking daisy down hopefully for a nap and um, so we can just chill out for a little bit and um, I'm trying to think of something healthy to make for tea after what we ate for lunch. Oh, and I'm just waiting for it to get to an acceptable time so I can make myself a little gin later. It's about two o'clock now. Um, I don't want to start too early because, you know, it's not like we're wild ones with two kids at home today. So, yeah. We're going to give you something to eat. Whoa, oh, 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 oh
Making each other oh so happy yeah. And you know I remember All of the things we used to do Nothing could ever set us to the power Through all the happy times of joy and laughter Through all the fights and all our makeups after yeah. You've always been there to make me feel better you are, you know I'll be there. So it is now 20 past five and Mark and I aren't really hungry yet after our dirty, dirty Yorkshire pudding wrap earlier. <laughs> so I'm gonna make Daisy a quick tea because she's, well, she's always hungry and Stanley's just had a bottle, but obviously it's just her, so I'm gonna do something that is really special and will make her very happy because I've got these. And she blinking loves Peppa Pig. And there's Pepper, George, Teddy, Rabbit, Elephant, Crown, and Pepper Face, according to this little bit here. But I'm going to put these on and do a little sauce for her and then do some like cucumber sticks and tomatoes and that kind of thing. And hopefully she'll be very happy with that and we'll eat it all up and then sleep really well tonight. And I can have a little old chin. Stanley is just in here in his little sneeze pod with his dummy. He's just woken up, but he seems happy for now. And then Daisy is in our bed watching this who rhymes on my phone while I quickly get ready because um two of our friends, um, whose wedding we went to when I was still pregnant, I don't know if you remember that vlog, but um they are coming around today. Jenna is pregnant with her first baby and they're all into this thing called UFC, like Mark likes it, it's Ultimate Fighting Championship or something like that. And obviously they're coming to see Stanley as well because they were on their honeymoon when he was born, which was so cute. And um, that's exciting. It's nice to have some visitors. And um, they're all going to watch that and I'm going to make bacon butties and stuff and just chill. And um, then I think plans for the rest of the day are just to make some toad in the hole with mash and some veggies and gravy for us three and Stanley can watch us eat it and then just be lazy I think because um, I don't know I don't really feel like doing much else today other than being lazy I'm just going to put a little bit of makeup on because my postpartum skin is all over the place at the moment it's gone so dry like on my body and then like my face has gone all dry and patchy and like the pores on my nose have gone like dry. It's really weird. Um, so I just want to like spruce myself up a little bit because I'm a little bit self-conscious of the state of myself at the moment. But that's okay. It's normal. 
Um, and yeah, it's not going to be a very exciting one, but I like days like this. I like getting out and about, but I also think that recharging the batteries is really good for this old tube. Did you not want mummy to get ready? Hey? Oh dear. Okay, well you can sit on my knee and we'll just see how successful this goes. One handedly. Hey? Is that better? Is that better? Did you miss me? I missed you. I did miss you. Should we give you a bath, Mr. Squishy? Wee! Oh. Oh, do we hate it? Could you pass me Stan's flannel? It's in the cupboard here. I forgot to get it. Are you going to cry your eyes out? You think it's a little smile? Are you think it's a little smile? Why are you so cute? Why are you so cute? You're like my little buddy, aren't you, today? They're watching a the fight in and we're just being busy mates. I need to sterilise this bottle. So Mike and Jenna have just gone and I think it's about half two now and I'm just nipping across to Waitrose to get a few bits and to pick up a parcel um, and I ordered a new Charlotte Tilbury bronzer highlighter duo and I um, can't wait to get it because I've not had it for ages and it was like a postpartum treat to myself. I was going to cook um, toad in the hole with mash and veg and gravy but because it's already getting on a bit and we like to eat like kind of mid-afternoon on a Sunday. Mark's like, should we just get a takeaway? And we haven't had one for a while, so that is what we're going to do. And I'm very excited. I don't know which one yet though. But yeah, it's been a really, really chilled and relaxing day and I've really enjoyed myself. It's nice to see those two because they're so lovely and I cannot wait for their baby girl to arrive. So I'm back from the shops. I got myself a cheeky little coffee. But yeah, I thought I would just quickly show you what I bought because like, why not, hey? I always find that little shops, like you know when you go in for a couple of things and come out with a few more, are the most interesting. So first thing I got was a Method hand wash and this is a foamy one. And the reason why I got it is because we also have one over here that I bought yesterday, I think, and they're on offer at the moment, like reduced away through. And it's so nice and I thought I would just get another for the bathroom upstairs. Then I got some caramel snacker jacks just because I'm trying to rein in my snacks and eating a little bit at the moment before I start Swimming World in a couple of weeks time. So I also got some naked blueberry muffin um, bars as well because apparently these ones are really, really nice. Um, that was what I went to go and pick up, the Charlotte Tilbury Film Star Bronze and Glow. So it's like a contour on one side and a highlight on the other and I've had one before and it lasted me absolutely ages and I love it. Then I got a half loaf of Seeded Bloomer, this Jackson's brand, I really really like, the bread is always super soft. I got a bottle of Sauvignon Blanc which is what I drink and this is a Australian one. Um, I got this one mainly because it was refrigerated and already cold. I stocked up on some formula because we are running low and I just, the one thing I don't like about formula and I remember this when we had Daisy like later on, when it starts to run out it always makes me feel twitchy and I hate that feeling. Um, I've got some Alpin, this is new and it's no added sugar, blueberry, cherry and almond muesli so I thought I would try that with some yogurt and fruit for breakfast. Speaking of the fruit, I've got some strawberries and some nanas as well and then Mark asked me to pick him up some mixed seeds so I did and I also got these breadsticks to put us on for a bit because they were on offer as well and they're parmesan and poppy seed and sound really nice. So it's five o'clock and this is how I am editing at the moment. So Stanley's here and my MacBook is here 
and I'm editing footage from this weekend and Mark and Daisy have gone to go and get a chippy tea so that would be quite nice and I'm just trying to make out one to call this a day because it's quite a long vlog I think we're at like 16 minutes already so um yeah I might end it shortly but hopefully you've enjoyed it <laughs> bothered about what could be coming every day we danced and life was smiling we were young and drunk and 